So I think one of the one of the challenges if you if you're going to go that high, uh, it's not so much a technical challenge, it's uh, it's more of a uh, uh, I think you need a bit of a plan B and a plan C mentality as to how the, de the design, the function of the building could change during the gestation period. In other words, uh, we've got to make the uh, the design quite flexible, so it's that changes can be made to actually reflect what the economics, uh, uh, the microeconomics, or the macroeconomics of the time dictate. And I have to say, honestly, the biggest single limitation to where we're going to go, what height we can reach, is the attention span of our developer. Burst Khalifa took us seven years to build. Okay, So if we're thinking of doubling the height of Burj, would a developer wait 14 years? In my view, probably not. Uh, another thing is um, someone of vision. Okay, you, you know, you have to have somebody who has has a vision. I'm talking about the developer now, you know, the developer of the city or the government or, or wherever this might occur, who who has the, you know, has the optimism and vision to, to try to do something like this because it is it, it is, um, you know, ambitious though quite doable these days. Quite, let me say, it is quite doable. We're also limited in on the MEP side of it, which is my specialty. We're limited with the pressures. Taller buildings have a higher pressure exerted on the uh, water system. We haven't been able to adopt technologies that are available for oil and gas industry, which uses very high pressure equipment pieces. We haven't been able to adopt that into uh, commercial application yet. Well, for me, I think uh, right now, uh, I think uh, uh, creating a modular systems uh, will remain. And now also, as I mentioned, uh, is how do we make the building lighter, uh, much faster to build. If you make the building heavy, it becomes very difficult to build it. And at uh, this moment, what we need to uh, building are made, we need to memorize the weight, which means that we also need to develop systems uh, that's a modular system construction that makes it faster to build.